It was late Sunday night. The car door closed softly. Footsteps came up the stairs. Young Pastor Tony met his wife at the entrance. His face lined with a thousand cares. We've been here two years and nothing's changed. These people won't listen at all. I am out of answers and I'm feeling small. But as he read in the Bible, page after page, his heart was convinced to stay in the race. He knelt by his desk, then lay on the floor. Though I don't understand what it's for, I'll trust one day more. I'll pray again, I'll kneel again, I'll knock on the door, ask him for more, strength for the fight, peace in the night, trusting by faith, the answer he'll send. At a quarter past two, again in the morning, a mother wakes up again. Her youngest daughter has a special condition. They say that she won't pass ten. The worry's so great and nothing's changed. Does God understand us at all? We're out of answers and we're feeling small. But as she read in the Bible, page after page, the comfort came in right along with grace. Her hand held her daughter and they knelt on the floor. Though we don't understand what it's for, We'll trust one day more. We'll pray again. We'll kneel again. We'll knock on the door, asking for more. Strength for the fight, peace in the night. Trusting by faith, the answer he'll send. We'll pray again. darkness surrounds you and God seems so silent, your back's against the wall. You may be tempted to doubt God's goodness, it feels like he won't hear your call. The questions take shape and cloud your mind, is God in control after all? My life's out of balance, and I'm going to fall. But if you'll read in the Bible, page after page, you'll see that he's there, and he'll never forsake. Surrender your life is all you must do. You'll begin to see God's point of view. He's there to change you. Go pray again. Go kneel again. Go knock on the door. Ask him for more. Strength for the fight. Peace in the night. Trusting by faith. The answer he'll send. Go pray again.
I'll pray a 